YouTube. I was popping YouTube. And all I ask, cuz, is that he doesn't mess with the medication, cuz. That he keeps that process going, cuz. That process of prohibition, legalization, of the herbal essence, cuz. Okay, cuz. So we need that, cuz. Niggas is catching mandatories, petty ass sentences for bags of weed, being on probation, shit, cuz. And I'm just trying to free my mind, cuz. And you grabbing pussies, cuz. Okay. So right now, cuz, we getting into this top ten reasons. Why we should accept our president-elect, Donald Trump, as our president, cuz. Maybe, cuz. And you ain't giving out them tax reports, cuz. And I'm about to back you clean right now, cuz, okay? So let's get into the top count, cuz. Whoop, whoop. Okay, cuz. Coming in at number 10, cuz. We got Donald Trump's family tree, cuz. Okay, cuz. Trump was born June 14, 1946, son of Fred and Mary Ann McLeod Trump, cuz. Trump's dad, born in New York, settled with his mother, cuz, that was immigrated to America at 17 with her sister, cuz, where they met in Queens and settled down, okay? Trump's grandfather, who was an important piece of their puzzle, cuz, who immigrated to America at 16 in 1885, cuz, in 1892, after becoming a U.S. citizen, he took advantage of the Canadian Klondike Gold Rush by opening a range of restaurants and hotels for gold seekers, cuz, controlling the market, cuz, and I'm pretty sure they, he, had his little hand into a little bit of cat house dwelling, cuz, okay, cuz, after Trump's granddad died, cuz, he left everything to Trump's dad, cuz, and grandmother, cuz, when they started Elizabeth, Trump, and sons, cuz, okay, which Trump's dad later changed to the Trump Organization, cuz, and check this, cuz, Trump's granddad is related to Henry J. Hines, cuz, H.J. Hines Company, cuz, catch up, cuz. Catch up, cuz, okay? Just to say, cuz, he comes from a long family of business ties, and regardless of the band that he tried to put in place, cuz, he has nothing but foreign blood running through his veins, cuz. His mom is Scottish, his granddad's German, come on, cuz. Those are the foreign types they like, cuz. Master builders and Nazis, cuz. LOL, cuz. LOL, cuz. Okay, cuz. Jumping back in at number nine, cuz. We got Melania Trump, cuz, okay? And little Pirate, I see the benefits in Melania Trump being our first lady straight like this, cuz. Russia and China are buying up everything, cuz. Straight like this, cuz, stuff is drying up left and right everywhere, cuz. Although she is a former model and 30 years or so younger than Trump, okay, this is Trump's third wife, okay, and she is the second foreign-born first lady of the U.S., cuz, okay, and just her nationality alone, cuz, could mean a bridging of gaps, a combining of power, cuz, which will help with the foreign relations, cuz, and the building of our economy, cuz, okay, cuz, coming in at number eight, cuz, we got a better nuclear war policy, cuz, okay, it's about to get technical, cuz, okay, the U.S. and Russia maintain each an estimated 700 high alert nuclear warheads, cuz, okay, Folks, that's like 90% of the world's 15,000 warheads, cuz. Okay, if they start beefing, cuz, we're radiation toast, cuz. Okay, the international position for the prevention of the nuclear war says once the clock, that biological clock hits 12, cuz, we're smithereens, cuz. And we're only 2.5 minutes away from that happening, cuz. So these people are just in conversation beef all day. Day, cuz delegation politics parlay all day, cuz okay. We were five minutes before the end of the 2015 Obama administration, cuz while Obama was in office, cuz the U.S. refused to renounce the first use of nuclear weapons, the Senate refused to ratify the Comprehensive Test Ban Treaty, the U.S. also opposed the U.N. resolution 
in support of the 2017 conference to abolish nuclear weapons, Kaz, which was signed by 123 other nations, including North Korea, Kaz. All of this occurring as relations between U.S. and Russia was falling apart, Kaz. Okay, Kaz? So you see what I mean by the benefits of the First Lady being in office, Kaz? Okay, Kaz. Coming in at number seven, Kaz, we got building relations with China, Kaz. Okay, guys, he might have to watch what he says on Twitter, Kaz. But on December 9th, 2016, Trump says that we must build and rebuild relations with China, Kaz, because they have been playing by the rules, Kaz. Educate, design, engineer, and sell the product, okay, Kaz? So they educate it, they design it, they engineer, and they sell their products, Kaz. America has lost its roots of building, Kaz, okay? We market everything. Everything, we sell everything, but we don't build our own products, Kaz. And I think that's where Trump got lost in the sauce, Kaz, of rebuilding the economy with less outsourcing and importing and building the employment rate in America by creating jobs here using our own as well, Kaz, okay? And as well exporting our goods, okay? And doing the same, Kaz, just doing us as well, Kaz, minding our business. Okay, Kaz. Coming in at number six, Kaz, we got his net worth, Kaz, okay? During campaigning, when Trump was asked what his net worth was, Kaz, the campaign team boosted it to exceed $10 billion, Kaz, okay? A report found his total debt largely from massive bank loans rocketed from $350 million in 2015 to Six hundred and thirty million in 2016. Other observers and even his own party suspicious of him, cause, cause he won't release those tax reports, cause. Okay, Forbes pegged Trump's net worth to be 3.7 billion dollars, cause. After analyzing 28 assets or asset classes, cause, the magazine found Trump's wealth dropped down to 800 or so million when 18 assets went down in value, cause. Okay, official presidential salary set at $400,000, additional 50,000 in expenses. Trump is going to make money off of pre-existing income sources, okay, speaking arrangements, okay, and uh, entertainment cause, travel budgets, cause, hopefully he can do the same for America, cause, so everybody can start having, cause, okay, cause. At number five, cause, we got the building the economy and the real estate history, cause, okay, throughout the history of America and the funding and founding and naturalization process of it, cause, of their own land, cause, Finding prime real estate and building upon it and then occupying the space, cause, has been the number one way of rebuilding, buying, and selling, cause, real estate, cause, okay? At 28, in 1974, he had become the president of his dad's built company, cause. By 1976, Trump started developing massive properties in Manhattan. One success story, cause, being the development of the properties from the Penn Central Railroad Company's Kaz, his dad Kaz started off buying, building, and selling small family homes in Queens Kaz, which built the business that Trump's dad left in his succession to him after he died in 1999. Kaz, that to say, Kaz, we rebuild the land, we rebuild the house, and then we rebuild the people. Kaz, okay, Kaz. Okay, Kaz, coming in at number four, Kaz. We have his failures, Kaz, okay? Trump did have a considerable head start from his real estate developer father, Kaz, but that goes to say, Kaz, you gotta make some mistakes, Kaz, in this game to know what people like and what people just don't like, Kaz, what to do and what not to do, Kaz, okay? One example of that, Kaz, was in 1988, Kaz, Trump took out a $248 million loan, Kaz, to purchase Trump Airlines, Kaz. 
Okay, Kaz, it was to purchase the planes, the routes of Eastern Air Shuttle, Kaz. The gold trim bathrooms and the detailed Trump logos, Kaz, flow between New York to D.C., Kaz. Okay, et cetera, Kaz, okay? But the people just weren't impressed, Kaz. They just weren't feeling it, Kaz. And they couldn't cover the million-dollar interest rate, defaulting, surrendering ownership of the airline to its creditors, Kaz, okay? But in 1980, eight years earlier, Kaz, he bought the Commodore Hotel, cause, which was completely run down, cause, and he modernized it, cause. He modernized the outside, cause. He re he renovated the inside, cause, and then, cause, that was his first construction project in Manhattan, cause, which he would later sell for up to a hundred and forty-two million dollars, cause. You gotta take the good, the bad, with the ugly, cause. Jumping into number three, cuz, we got making America great again, cuz. And to little pirate, when Trump says he's gonna make America great again, cuz, I think he is referring to solving our own problems, cuz. And me living in America, cuz, in a lower part of society, cuz, I personally, cuz, I'm sorry, cuz, I don't have time to worry about someone else struggling in a third world country, cuz, okay? Not that I, little pie rip, is not concerned about those people which struggle in these third world environments, and my heart goes out to them, cuz, okay? To every person starving, cuz, around the world, cuz. It's just you have to understand, cuz, people in the ghettos of America, cuz, black people, period, going through the naturalization process themselves, cuz. We're starving and dying daily here, cuz, okay? And they're not sure whether or not, I'm not sure if. Everyone, foreigners, people, everyone are playing these games, okay, cuz, okay? The mass settlements in these neighborhoods, who knows, cuz, okay? That's why they're looking for, you know, minority groups, m minority people, period, being linked, and their members being linked to murders and drugs that could be be bringing them to our communities because it can create a whole new predicted crime wave, okay? That can be further stressing our community, cuz. Okay, cuz. Okay, cuz. We're winding down at number two, cuz. It's education, cuz, okay? Trump's education, cuz, was very to the point, cuz, as if he was grassrooted for something, cuz, not to be the president, cuz, but for success. Business development, cause okay. Trump's family had a mansion in Jamaica, Queens, in support of his real estate developer father, cause okay, where he attended private school, cause okay. That he was kind of rough around the edges, cause okay, okay. When his father discovered his aggression, cause he sent him off to New York Military Academy, cause okay. And they say Trump has no military experience, cause okay. During his senior year, cause he graduated wank all the way up to captain, cause okay. Trump graduated to go on to Fordham University in the Bronx, cause then later transferring to the place he always talks about, cause. Wharton School of the University of Pennsylvania, cause, in Philadelphia, cause, which offered one of the few real estate studies departments in the United States of academia at that time, cause, he graduated in May 1968, cause. Okay, cause, we've reached the end of this whole scenario, cause, and right now, cause, I'm just gonna give you my... Little Pie Rip's opinion, guys, on why Donald Trump was a worthy candidate and why we should maybe trust him as our president, guys. Just get a guy a chance, guys, okay? And just first thing first, guys, I'm just going to start off by saying, guys, I don't know if you guys remember when Bush was in office, guys. Not to say that we are the talent, guys. Black people are the talent, guys. And we don't deserve ownership of, you know, what said computer, guys, that we do own, guys. Knowledge, guys, okay? Uh, come on, cuz. Black people were, you know, movies were up, cuz. Talent was out, cuz. It was, it was looking nice for the black man, cuz. But just being in that position of entertainer, cuz, we shouldn't be looked at as jokesters, cuz. And we should be taken very serious. And it shouldn't be just entertainers that influence the community, cuz. Actual speakers. Black men need to step up and speak, cuz. And you know, I would say that Trump and his family, cuz, understand coming from nothing, building something, making something, and being a succession. So, so coming from nowhere, 
to being something, cause okay. And in my life, my eyes, cause Republic Republicans, cause they different from Democrats, cause Democrats to me, cause blue collar families come from money, raised from money, cause just blue wing extremists, cause they come from money, they're raised from money, they already own the they already own the house, cause just like Crips and Bloods, cause okay, it was a separation of some type of power, cause. I mean, something had to happen, cause okay, cause I mean, blacks are all embodied in this community together, cause Crips own the community. They're beefing with the street over, cause okay, those people try to retaliate. They change their name. They call themselves blood. They rise to power, cause it's the same exact thing, cause with the Democrats, cause just working class people, the kingship, cause that come from power, background power, background money. They come from money, cause they're wealthy families that come from money, and then the Republicans. Republicans just working class Americans, guys, okay, guys, that come from nothing, that build the generals, that protect the land, guys, okay, it's, it's, it's kind of like the same thing, guys, you know, it's a little bit more aggression, guys, just think about it, guys, we got more, guys, tune in later, guys, guys, I just want to know who and where is the median to all this crisis, guys, a whoop, whoop, a what's popping again, cuz? That was Little Pie Rip's top 10 reasons why we should accept our president elect, Donald Trump, as our president, cuz. If you agree with Little Pie Rip, if you don't agree with Pie Rip, comment down below, cuz. Hit the like button, smash that up, cuz. Hit the unlike button. I don't give two shits and two tits, baby. Okay, cuz? All right, cuz. So, you know what I'm saying, cuz? Just like, comment, and subscribe below, cuz. All right? This little pirate checking in, checking out, cuz. A oh, whoop, whoop. <laughs>